Hi, I'm Johnny Key. Thank you for joining me for another edition of Key Points. I hope you are finding these short videos very informative. This month I'm excited to tell you about a new education career pathway for high school students. The Certified Teacher Assistant Pathway Program will begin this fall at high schools around the state, allowing students who are interested in a career in education to receive a certification as a teaching assistant, or CTA, by the time they graduate from high school. A joint initiative by the Arkansas Department of Education, Arkansas Department of Career Education, and Arkansas Department of Higher Education, this certification serves as the first step on a career ladder by giving students the opportunity to gain valuable work experience while working in a professional environment. Students will have the opportunity to take education-related coursework while still in high school and will receive the certification after successfully passing the Parapro assessment. As a certified teaching assistant, the individual would be eligible to work as a paraprofessional in public schools after high school allowing him or her to gain valuable experience while also attending a two or four year university. The goal is to then extend the opportunity through the college journey with educator preparation programs allowing CTAs credit for experiential learning. Upon completing a teacher preparation program and applicable licensure requirements, the student will receive a teaching license. This is a great opportunity for students we will be sharing more information with high school counselors and administrators, so be sure to check with them to learn more. ADE's Arkansas Professional Pathway to Educator Licensure, or APPLE program, is now offering a computer science option for those interested in becoming a licensed teacher. APPLE is a two-year, non-traditional licensure program that allows participants with a four-year degree in a field other than education to become licensed teachers. Program participants can work in the classroom as teachers while completing coursework toward obtaining their teaching license. With Governor Asa Hutchinson's Computer Science Initiative, public schools are emphasizing the importance of computer science skills. As more classes are being taught, the need has increased for computer science teachers. The Apple program is assisting with efforts to ensure there are enough licensed computer science teachers to meet this growing demand. This new addition to the Apple program is a great opportunity for individuals with bachelor's degrees in computer science. Not only will this program allow them to share their knowledge with students, it also will help build a strong workforce for the future. To learn more, visit the Apple page on our website. I want to welcome Brad Montgomery as the new director of the Arkansas Division of Public School Academic Facilities and Transportation. The Commission for Public School Academic Facilities and Transportation recently selected Mr. Montgomery as the new director. As director, Mr. Montgomery will oversee programs that assist Arkansas public schools with providing adequate and safe facilities and transportation for students, including the Education Facilities Partnership Program. Mr. Montgomery has an extensive background in education facilities management. He has managed multi-million dollar budgets and has demonstrated his dedication to public schools. To learn more about Mr. Montgomery, check out the press release on our website about his appointment. On March 2nd, millions of students around the country will celebrate the National Education Association's Read Across America Day. The day not only honors Dr. Seuss's birthday, it also celebrates the importance of reading. Reading is a fun activity families can do together every day of the year. I encourage you to make time each day to read with your child. Finally, I would like to spotlight Jasmine Peterson, Alexis Lorio, and Travis Cummings at the Bryant School District. The students are featured in videos that demonstrate their readiness for college and careers. In the videos, Ms. Peterson, Ms. Lorio, and Mr. Cummings discuss how the school has provided them opportunities to be successful. I commend these students for their effort to embrace learning and become ready for college and careers beyond high school. Thank you for watching Key Points. Visit our communications page at arkansaseded.gov for the latest ADE news and information. Be sure to like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter.